the Tinno So is next. Um, that's a tin furlong group one for three dollars at once. And the top one is Caballo, Simo for Obi Wan, Gunrunner, and Highland Reel for Dan Hughes. Jet Setter for Alex Cherry, Munir Edition for Thomas Rogers, Nickel for Adam Old, a lengthy breath for Ryan Costello, Bieber Raw, Martin Lidham, Styling and Profiling Obi Wan. Well, what do you think, Lucy, for Satyam and Gong Beauty, James Shea, Safran Abed for B. Fotheringham, Temple of the King, Martin Lidham, 3 2 1 for Ryan Costello, Lady Oscar, Alex Cherry, McGull, Darren Thompson, and she's a cracker for Satyam so 17 of them then and a couple of Satyams in it so there'll be some pace in this and ready to go and away we go then big field and as usual mine's drawn widest of all but it's she's Cracker who's gone off into the lead as we thought then from Gunrunner and Steiner and Profiling his next then comes a lengthy breath and Jet Setter, Bieber Raw, Wine on the Track's got away from that bad draw, but it's She's a Cracker that's got the lead then from Styler and Profiling in second. Then a lengthy breath and gun run, and then Wine on the Track, Bieber Raw, and 3 2 1. And then Munir Edition and Jet Setter, and the Gong Beauty is also next to that one. And then Saffron about, and Lady Oscar looking to the back. Temple of the King is the back marker, but She's a Cracker is in front by about a length and a half to Styler and Profiling in second. Then comes Gun Run and Bieber Raw, and 3 2 1. Widest on the track, they're going to lose ground on the turn but it's Cheese a Cracker who's in front from Styling and Profiling. These two are clearing out of trouble going well on the rail. is Gun Runner 3 2 1. He's back in fourth but wide. Bieber Roar under pressure. Then a Munir Edition and Gong Beauty and Jet Setter are also there as well. Temper of the King is going to try and go for a dream one up the inside. Be a miracle if he gets through but it's Cheese a Cracker by two to Styling and Profiling in second. Then 3 2 1 is trying to get across. Then comes Gun Runner. A lengthy breath is after that one and Munir and Saf Saf run about McGull is trying to get into it as well so too is Jet Setter another one that's caught wide is Caballo Simo but it's Cheese a Cracker from Gunrunner and now 3-2-1 coming through the challenge McGull is there as well as they race down towards the three furlong pole it's still Cheese a Cracker in the lead from McGull and 3-2-1 on a lengthy breath then Saf run about then after that one comes Munir Edition styling and profiling Gunrunner's hit a flat spot Bieber Raw still trying to run on they've got two furlongs to go and it's still Cheese a Cracker in the lead from a lengthy breath and 3-2-1 Saf run about round the outside Side McGull trying to burst through horses. Then also after that one comes from Styling and Profiling. Gunrunner's trying to get back into it. They're at the furlong pole. And a lengthy breath takes it up. It's a lengthy breath who's gone on. He's pulling away. It's a lengthy breath from Styling and Profiling. And wide on the track. Well, what do you think, Lucy? But it's a lengthy breath in front as they raise them towards line. A lengthy breath from Styling and Profiling. Well, what do you think, Lucy? They flash past the post together. Caballo Simo finishing like an absolute rocket. And four across the track. I don't know whether. The long time leader hung on. I think it probably did. It's close. It looks like a lengthy breath has taken it. And it was an exciting finish for this low grade, grade one. And let's take a look and see if it's a dead heat. It's a win for a lengthy breath for Ryan Costello in the 0 to 100 Group 1. With second is. Well, what do you think, Lucy, for Satyam? Styling and profiling for everyone was third. Who also took fourth with Caballo Simo that was drawn wide and came with an absolute rocket of a run. Saffron about for B. Fotheringham was fifth. So some different name trainers getting mixed up in the Group 1 stuff there.